the side to breathe in. You know? <laughs> Oh. Uh oh yeah. Oh. Oh my God. Oh. Yes. <laughs> That's what they all say. Uh. Hi there. Hey, Dr. Trumpy. How are you doing today? Hey, it's so good to see you. You know, we've done a lot together. True. You've done a lot to me. There we go. Okay, play flat. Oh. Uh. Today, we, we want to, you know, pay the gift forward to our hardworking team. Try team here, they work so hard on our videos, but they never get to jump into the tries. Look how, look at them. They want to have some fun. <laughs> they are some fun people. I'd like to work with them. Today, the try team is getting our bones cracked. My day today is the assistant production coordinator. Fancy term for I just kind of do a little bit of everything. <laughs> Hi, I'm Keelan and I'm the content strategist for the Try Guys. It's literally my job to like be looking down at my phone all day, so I'm probably going to start feeling the effects of that pretty soon. Oh, that was a really good. I am a video editor, so I will be editing this video. I am sitting on my desk every day for like eight, nine hours. <laughs> that was a good one. <laughs> I'm the post-production coordinator, uh, which means mostly that I'm helping with all ends of the beginning and the end of the videos as the footage comes in and as it gets finalized. Oh. Hi there. Hi. I'm Dr. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I'm so nervous. My name is Dr. Mary Trumpy and I'm a chiropractor. Chiro actually means, I think it's a Latin word for hand, so it's a way to do, provide health services kind of with your hands. So chiropractic is a way to isolate and determine any misalignments in the spine. You know? Okay, a little bit. Okay, lay on your back. I am scared. <laughs> I've broken bones before. I have cracked a few, so the idea of you know having somebody mess around with your joints and bones is a little scary to do it on purpose. Have you been to a chiropractor before? No, I'm are very you, scared. Are you nervous? Yeah. <laughs> You've seen some chiropractic adjustments and videos and no, things. No, actually, I was telling Zach that the Try Guys video is the only video I saw. I didn't even know what a chiropractor was until the Try Guys video. And to be honest, Zach, I didn't watch the Try Guys video until yesterday. <laughs> <laughs> Imagine me before the pandemic, living large, but still living a pretty seven sedentary lifestyle. Now, cut to 13 months later. It's so much worse. I, I'm, I spend all my time in front of the computer. I'm pretty sure I have a heritably bad back. I have a lot of memories of my father doing stretches in his tidy whities every single morning because that's what he does. To be totally real, like the pandemic has just made everybody so messed up, right? So when it first happened, right, everyone's, we're walking, we're doing our little band exercise. We're all excited because we are now going to be fit, we're gonna walk, and then that lasted probably a month or two, then everyone just kind of fell off. And then suddenly everybody just became way more stationary. It's got a lot of neck pain from sitting, just spent all my day in a little chair. Can't wait for my body to get a little exercise. Yes, I did. As far as I'm concerned, today is exercise. The kind of thing that's gonna keep my body on the right track instead of falling further into this pit of, of despair from the pandemic that I've fallen into. Even more sedentary than previous. I'm deep into the YouTube web of bone cracking. So oh I, I know all the moves, I'm very excited. My nerves aren't like that my neck's gonna snap or anything. I'm afraid I'm gonna like fart or rip my pants or something really embarrassing, but like, do whatever you want with my body. How many computer screens do you have? Two. Okay. So as a chiropractor, this is just kind of what we call motion palpation. We want to see if there's movement in the spine. And you can see like there's a nice spring. But as I get here, there's like not as much movement. We're taught in chiropractic college, you know, to be able to go along, palpate the spine, touch all the bones, find areas that are out of alignment. So in the spine, if a bone is not perfectly aligned, it's called a subluxation. Can I breathe in, please? Yeah, no. Oh my God! <laughs> I wasn't, I wasn't expecting that. I'm breathing this. I know. as bad as I thought, okay. The crack sound is a gas. So on, for example, in the spine, if you adjust the neck, there's like 
eight different contacts. So when you open it, there can be eight different little sounds that comes out. It's a nitrogen gas that your body stores inside every joint. So when you move it, it escapes and makes that noise. And a... Oh, man. Nice. Oh, man. Oh, that feels good. So good. Okay, now, breathe in, please. Oh, man. That was a good one. If somebody, a uh, new patient comes in, um, we always take a history telling me about all the injuries that you've had or your desk work or any broken bones. Do you have any major pain going on right now? Not right now, but I do have a comprehensive list of injuries for you. Um, I broke both my ankles, okay. femur, oh. arm, my tailbone. I do have one shoulder injury that I'm actually concerned about. Right. The only like constant pain that I have is I've got plantar fasciitis in my left foot. Uh, plantar fasciitis yeah. is on the bottom of the foot is a thick surface called, it's the plantar Plantar surface. If someone's arch has a tendency to drop a little bit, it pulls that fascia, gets all inflamed, and the bottom of your foot hurts. Probably hurts a lot in the morning. My theory is when he lays down, he's gonna have a right short leg. Breathe in, please. <sighs> so I have a glossing spondylitis, inflammatory disease, stiffness and tension and pops all the time. <sighs> Because ankylosing spondylitis is a condition that some people get, and it's uh, the joints actually start to fuse. Chiropractic's great, causes them just extra stiffness, so. <laughs> and then she gets the tension here. Yes. Oh my god, that feels so good. What are these things? I don't know. <laughs> So I'm on my computer all day okay. for like eight, nine hours a day okay. in this position. Um, so every time my like shoulder and neck, this area hurts so much. So we want to have good posture like this. You want your ears to be aligned over your shoulders. As you start coming forward, it's the muscle holding up the neck. And then if you're looking at your screen, you got to do this. That jams the base of your skull, pinches that nerve, starts causing you headaches. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> awesome. Ooh. What you thinking about, Will? So far, so good? So far, so good. <laughs> you know, I would say about 70% of my patients these days are having neck and back pain from stay-at-home work positions. All you guys and gals who are on your computers, if you do something repetitive, and you're in this weird position, try to think, I need to do the opposite of that, at least, you know, three, four times a day. Oh. And up. Nice, nice, nice. Oh. Ooh, that was a good one. You like it? It was good. We're good. Okay. All things are good over here. Okay. <laughs> 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 okay. <laughs> oh, that was a really good. Oh my god. Oh, yes. <laughs> That's what they all say. <laughs> so an adjustment is um, you find an area of the spine that's misaligned or subluxated, and you actually do a little bit of a force, and I know exactly which way to push it, crack it, turn it, flip it, to put everything back in place, and then the nerves will flow 100%. Oh my god. Turn in your side. Face me over here. Perfect. Low back first. Okay. Ooh. Oh, already did it. it already oh. happened. Oh. Hug yourself like you love yourself. I do love Please myself. Do. <laughs> uh, I think we got it. <laughs> now. Oh. Breathe in. And out. Oh. I'll stretch you first. Oh, your back is so tight. Are you really? Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that last one was, that was a lot. That was a lot. Can you? I know. Oh, yeah. Nice. You know? Oh, okay, a little bit. Okay, lay on your back. <laughs> that was a good one. <laughs> oh, we got it. <laughs> I'm gonna do your neck. Okay. It's gonna go nice and easy. Mm -hmm. The job's just to relax, okay, sir? Mm -hmm. And I can touch her neck and like with my 
Ah! <laughs> okay, so far you're good? You comfy? Yes. Nervous? No. Good. <laughs> I'm excited. Okay. <laughs> okay. And breathe in. And out. <laughs> there Ooh. it is. Oh, that's exhilarating, man. <laughs> oh, that was crazy. <laughs> It was great. It was exactly what I expected. I feel like my shoulders are like less heavy. I feel good. <laughs> I, I survived. I think after the first crack, I was like not nervous at all anymore. Like I was like, oh, okay, this is like, I'll, I'll be fine. The amount of force she pushes you, it's just enough to make you feel really good, but not painful. It doesn't hurt at all. It just feels really good. My whole body is feeling lighter and looser. Like I've got an energy coursing through me. I got to do more for my body. <laughs> But I've just let it fall by the wayside, and uh, it's nice to do something actively helpful. Well, thanks to the Tri Team for joining us today. Join us next week when they jump out of an airplane with us. <laughs> wow, they're into it. Okay, I thought that would get a no. No, I would love to go skydiving. I would do that. Oh, man. Wow, okay, great. You know what mullets do? It's due to the force of the hair production of the lower part. I have got to cut this hair off. <laughs> I've got to cut it off.